Brentech, yeah, where tech is made simple. So AMD has confirmed an issue that updating their Radiant software could cause issues and basically break your Windows installation. Now, according to um, AMD, apparently the Adrenaline 23.2.2 drivers that were rolled out a couple of weeks ago are causing um, boot issues and could corrupt Windows installations. Now, I must just say at the outset of this video that according to AMD, this, this issue is affecting more the minority than the majority of users. So it's a rare issue, but nonetheless has been confirmed by AM, AMD. And uh, um, apparently what's happening after updating, um, when some users reboot their PC to finish the driver installation, obviously um, it doesn't update, it doesn't start the Windows PC, it causes boot problems, and obviously you get that dreaded blue screen of death which obviously means there is a critical issue. Now, um, AMD has said, and I'm quoting this, that this issue can occur in an extremely small number of instances if a PC update occurs during the installation of AMD software, Adrenaline Edition, and they are actively investigating. And what they do is they recommend users ensure all system updates are applied. So basically check that all your system updates are applied or pause your updates. Um, before installing the driver and that the factory reset option which is um, an option on the tool is unchecked during the AMD driver installation process and um, they are trying to resolve issues as quickly as possible and that's a recent confirmation and announcement from AMD regarding that issue and if you are affected um, according to a a recent article by PC World, which by the way, I'll leave a link to in the description because it will just give you a little bit more information and um, it'll also give you um, a couple of things you can try as workarounds. But um, Windows um, Recovery Tools, according to uh, the article, should fix the issue. And um, basically another thing you can try is obviously um, rolling back to a um, previous system restore point if you can get into system restore. And if that doesn't happen, then obviously the worst case scenario would be uh, reinstalling Windows 10 or Windows 11 until AMD, as I say, um, resolves the issue and rolls out a fix. But nonetheless, I'll leave that article down below. But just wanted to let you know that that is um, affecting um, a small subset of users, but nonetheless has been confirmed by AMD that updating Radiant software could cause issues with your Windows installation. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.